Lauren, you look absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely. Doesn't she look great? Yeah. <laughs> and Justin, you clean up pretty well as well. Hardly recognize you. Lauren, Justin, today you're surrounded by your families and your closest friends. Some people you've known your entire lives, while others only for a few years. But no matter how long or under what circumstances they've known you, I'm sure that everyone here agrees that you're a remarkable couple who share common dreams, goals, and values. Today, you choose to celebrate what has already begun and no doubt will continue to flourish over the years. Remember that your friendship and your shared values of respect, commitment, and trust in one another are the reasons you've chosen to share the future together. Speak openly to one another and actively listen to what your partner is saying so that you'll understand your other's intentions and desires. Encourage each other to be the best you can be and together share your accomplishments as well as your disappointments. And may you always keep your hearts open and receptive to one another for as long as you both shall live. I ask you to turn and face your guest, please. Two people in love do not live in isolation. Their love is a source of mutual strength for one another and for those around them. Each guest present here today has been invited to celebrate with them and to witness the commitment they're about to make to one another. Will you, as family and friends, now promise to continue to nurture your relationship with them, support them through their challenges, and share in their joys and in their celebrations? If you will, Please respond together with a resounding, we will. We will. We will. Only one gentleman said no. <laughs> In 2015, Lauren made the move to Ottawa for a work opportunity where she met Justin. They were co-workers and became good friends who always enjoyed each other's company. Fast forward a few years and they started spending more time together with their colleagues outside of work. Justin asked Lauren on their first date in the summer of 2017. It was perfect. A beautiful Wednesday evening at the Moon Room on Preston Street. In fact, the night went so well that Wednesday nights quickly became a tradition, one that they still carry on to this day. And if you ask Lauren her version of the story, Justin started to spend more time and more time at her apartment. And then at some point, he just never left. <laughs> They loved their apartment on Frank Street, Street, where they spent many nights drinking wine, making homemade pizzas, and hanging out with their cat, Lex. <laughs> After four plus years together, a global pandemic, and a new house, Justin bought a ring and planned to propose, finally. <laughs> Justin planned the perfect proposal in Quebec City last June. Lauren said yes, and we're gathered here today to witness their commitment to one another and celebrate with them as they become husband and wife. Their friendship that began many days ago 
has flourished into a loving relationship built on unconditional love, trust, mutual respect, and open communication. And here, in front of the people who mean most to them, Lauren and Justin will make a promise to one another to continue to nurture their relationship and their friendship now and forever. We have gathered here today to witness and to support you as you join in marriage. And no question that the butterflies in your stomach are the surest proof how seriously you're taking your commitment. Many months of planning and dreaming have prepared you for this day. And as special as this day is, it's just the beginning of your adventure as a married couple. Saying your vows to one another, well, that's the easy part. Speaking them in front of your family and your closest friends, knowing that you'll have to live them out every day, now that's the challenge. It's your mutual responsibility to strive and bring joy and unconditional love into your marriage. And this can be achieved by diligently focusing to honor and live out the promises that you're about to make to one another. I ask you to turn face each other and join hands. Lauren, do you promise to encourage Justin as he strives to achieve his goals? And do you freely accept your differences without judgment, hesitation, or condition, and promise to love him unconditionally? If you do, please respond, I do. I do. Everybody heard that? No. I do. <laughs> <laughs> and Justin, do you promise to keep your heart open to Lauren's needs and desires? And will you also be her loudest supporter closest confidant and trusted friend. And you also promise to love and respect Lauren, share your life and your dreams with her, and build a home that's a place of joy, mutual commitment, and personal growth. If you do, please respond, I do. I do. Thank you. This moment when you're about to exchange your promises to one another reflects your past and is a choice that will impact your future. Today, you're beginning a journey together that will last your lifetime. And like any exciting journey, you'll experience amazing adventures and unlimited possibilities. Along the way, however, you will face some challenges. But no matter where you go or the difficulties you will face, the person whose very sweaty hands you're now holding <laughs> will be by your side throughout it all. May I ask you to say your vows? And if you can, hold one of his hands. Justin, today I choose you to be my partner in life and my loudest supporter. When I'm with you, I feel safe and unconditionally loved. For the rest of my life, I vow to love you totally and without reservation. I promise to keep our relationship exciting and adventurous. I promise to respect and appreciate all the little things that you do for us. I will trust and respect you, laugh with you, and cry with you. I will encourage and support your goals, ambitions, and dreams. And I promise to always be your, by your side throughout the celebrations of life. These promises I make to you today and all the days of my life. I love you. I love you. <laughs> oh, we're not allowed to kiss you. I know. <laughs> It's a good place to hug. Okay. We can <laughs> Lauren, from the moment we, ne we met, I knew you were the only one for me, the person I wanted to share my adventures and my life with. I promise to bring as much laughter and joy into your life as you've brought into mine. I promise to grow with you, trust you, and respect you. I promise to support you, love you unconditionally, and embrace your family and friends just like you've done mine. I love you with all my heart. I look forward to chasing our dreams together. I look to short forward to sharing more adventures with you. And then our next chapter. I love you. I want to kiss you. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. when, when Andrew brings the rings in, don't take them. I'll be back. Okay. okay. Andrew, may I ask you please to present the rings? Lauren and Justin, you have, chosen, you have chosen to exchange wedding rings to symbolize that your lives will be joined together through marriage. May they be worn as a constant reminder of the promises that you've just made to one another. Thank you. 
I ask you please to take this ring, Lord. Place it on his ring finger on his left hand. Slide it all the way on. And don't hide it. And please repeat after me. Justin, I give you this ring. Justin, I give you this ring. As a constant reminder of my promises. Of a constant reminder of my promises. To honor and to love you. To honor and to love you. For as long as I may live. For as long as I may live. It wasn't the ring. Mm -hmm. <laughs> slide it all the way on, please. And Justin, please repeat after me. Lauren, I give you this ring. Lauren, I give you this ring. As a constant reminder of my promises. As a constant reminder of my promises. To honor and to love you. To honor and to love you. For as long as I may live. For as long as I may live. You may have fallen in love by chance, but you're here today because you're making a choice. You've chosen each other. You've chosen to be with that very special someone who enhances you, who challenges you, who makes you smile and makes every day a little brighter. You've chosen to care for each other, to stand up for one another, and to find happiness in each other. And there's a common thread to each one of your promises. You vowed to be there for one another. You're teaming up and you're saying to your partner, every experience I'm ever going to have, I want you to be part of it. If you choose to honor the promises that you've made to one another, I suggest to you that your marriage will be more fulfilling and joyous than you ever imagined. May I please ask the guests to stand. As partners and best friends, You've kissed a thousand times over the years, maybe more, but today the feeling is new. Lauren and Justin, you've expressed your unconditional love and your faithfulness to one another through the promises you've just exchanged. Therefore, it's with great joy that, I, that we all pronounce you to be husband and wife. And Justin, may I ask you to kiss your beautiful bride if that's okay with you, Lauren. <laughs> Please do.